Just making sure that it's uh, still light. I have no idea what time it is once I go down here. So, a uh, little while back, we made this little uh, secret room in the throne room. Underneath my throne. Pay no mind. I'm just kind of spitballing on the ceiling here. So yeah, here's my throne. And I'm going to do something with the floor in here later. Here's my throne. And at the end of the day, when I am done listening to all the plebs little problems. Check this out. Invisible door. Underneath my throne. Goes down to my private chamber. Which, um... Is looking pretty bare right now, so let's uh, let's fix that. <coughs> Pardon me. I think first things first. Actually, no, I don't. I don't want to do that. I want. Let's see. Where is some uh, that stuff? That stuff right there. There we go. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it pretty. I'm gonna do the floor. I'm gonna do the walls. I'm gonna do the ceiling. Lord knows we got enough space to do all of them. Hey, buddy. Okay. So, um, the at launcher does give you the capability. I I didn't notice when this was added, but it was added at some point. I, you know, slowpoke.jpg. <laughs> Slowpoke.jpg has added the ability to clone your instances so that if a pack throws a major update and you're not sure if it's going to break your world, you can clone your instance, you can try it out, and if everything absolutely goes to crap, no worries, you still have your old instance, which you can restore. Well, you don't even have to restore it. Just get rid of the crappy instance. Get rid of the broken one. And off you go. So I, ch um, I did that with Karma. Karma had a little bit of weirdness happen, but nothing game-breaking. So that's good. Uh, however, the, the uh, pack creators do still recommend that you not upgrade your existing worlds. That you start new worlds. Whoops. But, you know, it, it seemed to work more or less okay. Natural magic, however, um, I tell you, if I was just doing creative building, it would be okay. So far. Um, I'm not just doing creative building. I'm also doing uh, survival. And lots of stuff disappeared. And it was awful. And I think maybe um, we'll just stick with the old version of the pack. So, yeah, that's... um. Okay, I'm going to do kind of the same thing we did in the courtyard. Which means... I'm going to have to rejigger my lighting here, but that's alright. <laughs> let's uh let's just put that away let's put that up there for now it, it's fine it's fine uh doop 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 so yeah this is going to be my private chamber uh in addition to my bed it's going to have a little tv area it's going to have a sweet stereo system. It's going to have uh, you know, a little, little kitchenette. I'll make a little, uh, little kitchenette. Now, normally I have a rule that everything that I do in creative has to be strictly aesthetic. However, the things I'm going to be adding are things like a furnace and a bathtub. A, um, a, home, a handmade bathtub, not a crayfish bathtub. Whoops. And a uh, jute box. And, uh, you know, the crayfish TV and stuff like that. So, um, although it's not strictly uh, just for looks. I'm just going to plop one of these down here. We'll break it later. 
Although it's not strictly just for looks, um, I think I'm okay bending the rule on that because they're not, you know, they're not really super unfairly helpful things. They're just for funsies. And also, uh, in the case of the jukebox, I have more than enough diamonds and can get more than enough wood to make about a hojillion jukeboxes. So, um, yeah. Music discs I cannot spawn in. I have to find or make those myself. Yes, we can, uh, we can make most of those, actually, thanks to magical crops. But, um, uh, there's that fossil record, nyuk, 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 that I found somewhere. And then uh, the Biomes of Plenty, I think, has a record. And there may be a couple of other... I think Biomes of Plenty actually has a couple of records. There's a couple, probably a couple others that I, I'm not aware of right off the top of my head. But, um... Yeah, music discs, I will get legit. It's kind of like the stable with the horses, you know? I, I'll build the stable creative, but, um, okay, uh, here's what I need to do. I need to put one of those there, because that's the center of the room. I need uh, to put some here, because that's the center of the room that way. I need to put here, here, and here to mark the center of the room. Okay, now I can carry on. <coughs> put that there, put that there. Okay, now I can carry on, and I might put another layer of bricks on the uh, bottom, the outside. Well, Sarah, you say, um, don't you need windows in here? Don't you need some windows in your private room? Don't you want some natural light? Hell no, I don't want any natural light. Got enough natural light in the rest of the friggin' castle. For my own room? No, I want that obnoxious friggin' orb in the sky as far away from me as you can get it. I want the day star away from me. I do not want to see it. I do not want to acknowledge its presence. I'm gonna come down here to my cave. I'm gonna watch TV. I'm gonna eat Doritos. Whoops. Oops. Or, you know, whatever Pam's Harvest Craft has instead of Doritos. And this is going to be my um, man cave, so to speak. You know. I mean, it's not. But, you know. Women can have man caves, too. You know, I, I might invite some friends down once in a while, but uh, then I'd have to kill them because nobody's supposed to know how to get in here. Well, I guess I can have my butler. I guess I can have a butler. Okay. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh, not quite done. Now done. Okay. There's that. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna... Go ahead and start on the wall here. And yeah, I'm covering up some blocks I've already placed. Big whoop. Big whoop. It's not that big a deal. It's creative. It's not like I mined these out. It's not like I'm covering up nine lapis. Wasting all my hard work. Now nah, I'm just I'm just throwing stuff at the wall. Literally throwing stuff at the wall and seeing what sticks here. And then I th I might micro block. I might micro block, or I might not. Or I might just uh, do you know stripes or something. Let's see. We'll see. We'll we'll just uh we'll. Again, literally, throw stuff at the wall and see what sticks. Okay, I might as well, uh, wee. I think what I'm gonna do 
Let's put some um, pillars of some sort down there. That would be sweet. Okay. And I think we're going to do um, kind of the same sort of thing on the ceiling, except not quite as fancy. Yeah, Cave Ambience, I hear you. Okay, and there's all of that. I think I'm just going to do this. Okay, I did something wrong here. There. But. Did I do the thing over here? What what have I, what have I done? I done messed up is what I done. That should be there after all. Okay, so there should be one here as well. Okay. Yeesh. Right, let's just cover up the ceiling with marble here. Okay. So we li lost a little bit of height in the room, but it's still, you know, one, two, three, four, five blocks tall, which is, you know, a decent ceiling for a uh, private chamber, I guess. I, I don't really need huge ceilings up in here. Now that ladder, or that ladder, that elevator should still work. Should, I say. Yes, I'm going to try it out. In just a second. Okay, that's it. Okay. Where the hell is it? There it is. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Let's try the elevator. Where is it? Oh god, where is it? Okay, and um, I think what I'm going to do... I'm going to look up. Okay, yeah, that is. Uh, hey. Put a little bit of light up in here. Get rid of that. So now we can uh, kind of see where the. Uh, Okay. Two, three. Sarah, you say, shouldn't you be working on the throne room itself first? Hell no. I want my room. I want to get my room squared away so I can stop sleeping in that one crummy room up there. I also want to get my personal chambers squared away before I get too much stuff moved in that room up there and end up uh, not being able to carry it all and store it all. Okay, cool. And now I'm gonna just, um, let's see, did I say I was gonna microblock this? I mean, we could just leave it we can't just leave it bricks. Let's um let's micro block it. I'm gonna turn my fan on here real quick. Ah, there we go. Um well poop. Uh oak, spruce, acacia, dark oak. Hell with it. Let's let's dark oak it. Seriously? Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, well, nope, still can't do it. Okay, well, screw that noise then. 
All right. Start uh, micro blocking. Oops. I'll do uh, some micro block paneling. We'll see if this uh, lags my game. Hopefully it won't. Now, I think I've tried this before. No, Builder's Blonde does not... Builder's Blonde. Builder's Wand doesn't work with micro blocks. So, uh, I'm going to have to do this and then... Whoops. I'll, uh, I'll come back. We'll, we'll do a quick cut here. And it'll look cool. Cool. Too cool for skewed. Why the hell is the Brady Bench movie a meme? What the hell is wrong with you, Tumblr? The Brady Bench movie. And then there are people who don't want it to be a meme anymore because they found out the Brady Bench movie was supposed to be a parody. And then it wasn't funny anymore. Oh my god, Tumblr, what the hell is your problem? Oops, excuse me. I burped. So I had um, pulled pork and pasta for dinner because uh, that feel when you go to grill you a cheese and you get the cheese out and you get the butter out and you heat up the little grill pan and you go to put the butter on the bread and then you notice the mold spot on the bread. And no grilled cheese for you. No sir, no ma'am. Okay, almost done. Almost done. Uh. 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 Alright. So I was thinking about some uh, other stuff to do while I was paneling the room here. I, I've got to have a bar. I, I've got to have a bar up in here. So, um, alright, well, the, the entire room is now coated in micro blocks except there's a problem um paintings H how 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 are paintings gonna work let's see um oh oh dear um Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, paintings, paintings are fine. Paintings are good. I will just have to uh, use the gannies, it looks like. And carefully, the, either the gannies or the bibliocraft. And just uh, ever so carefully, um, yeah, just uh, take out however many bits that I need. Okay. So, uh, let's first of all, let me get my bed. And this, yeah, um, we need to mark where the elevator is. Because otherwise, we ain't going to be able to see squat. Because it blends right in with the rest of the floor, doesn't it? There we go. There's where the elevator is. So I think um, let's have the bed back in here. And I'm going to make myself a nice big bed that I can, uh, you know, roll around in. Let's see. Uh, I want to get the ebony wood back. So that I can... Uh... You know, this makes a nice little headboard, too. Uh... There we go. Alright. Uh oh. Okay. Well, let's do this. I have a nice big bed. Because, you know, I, I tend to roll around and kick and all that stuff. Yeah, see, this is cool because I can have, like, uh, bookshelves up in here now. Alright. Um. Now let's get some uh, lapis. Oh, I'm looking right at it. Mm. And let's dye that sucker blue. I'm, I'm not trying to... There we go. That's what I'm trying to do. Okay. Um, what about... Ah, son! No! 
You do not need to get on the table, son. There you go. <sighs> ink. Give me that ink sack. I, I want to say I've tried this before, and it didn't work, but, um... No, that's not what I wanted to do. Son, shoo. Get. <sighs> not what I wanted to do. No, I'm not trying to sleep. I'm, I'm trying to... Son of a gun. Give me the bed. Give me the ebony. Give me the... Son? Get back. <sighs> Give me the lapis. Thank you. Okay. Now. Do we not have ebony bookshelves? Are those not a thing? No, they're not. Dang. That's a problem. Okay. Bookcase. Uh, dark wood. That works. So let's put that. Um, oh, crap. Right there. Let's get some, uh... Actually... Shelf. Son, get. Get a uh, dark shelf there. Okay, now here's a problem. Um, this is going to look like poop. It is. It's going to look poopy. So you know what? We're not going to do that. We're going to put more bookshelves up. One. Son, please go. Please shoo. Thank you. Oh my god. Okay. Now that done. Let's us, uh, let's get some dark oak. Actually, are these chiselable? They are, but they don't really look like dark oak anymore. That's fine. Um, okay, the bedroom is... So the quote-unquote bedroom is over here. Let's put, um... Let's put the bar... Over here. Oh, I've got mail. And there. And, um... Dark oak trapdoor. Is that a thing? That's a thing. Oh, oh, look at that. Get, get down. Get. <sighs> Actually, you know, I, I, I done messed up. Give me that back. I was actually going to do, um... Hang on. Hang on. Microblock? Hell no, you can't microblock that. Okay. Um, I don't really want to use obsidian, though. Um, what about black stained clay? Well, it doesn't need to be obsidian infused. It just needs to be... Oh, wait. Shh. Come on, man. Black stained glass, black stained clay. That should do it. There we go. That's more like it. And let me uh, cut one into those. All right. Son, get out. You're being a pain. Quit it. Now I can't remember where I put the bar. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, give me back that trap door. Okay. Oh, crap, that's not what I wanted to do. Yeah, it is. Oh, God, Sarah. What the hell, man? Okay. Trap door. Now, I want to put 
these. On the bar. Yeah? Yeah? Okay, cool. And here is what I'm going to do. I'm going to de-micro block this entire wall right here. Let's make that go away, shall we? Oh, let's not. Um, let's put that back. Let's put a... That's not what I want. Where are my dark wood? There we go. Put that there. Put that there. That there. And that there. Okay, now we got this. And that. There, son, get out. Get. Ugh. All right. So, now that we have a bar-like thing, we need bar shelves, which we need potion shelves. Actually, what we need is a little uh, prep station here. Ah. There we go. And, um, alright. Actually, I'm, I'm okay with doing this. It's not a sink, it's a basin. I'm okay with doing this because we've done it legit. And also because it's not terribly expensive. So we got that. Um, you know what, let's uh, go ahead and put in the, uh, the furnace. We'll just make this the kitchen slash bar area. And let's put a nice little counter top. Where where am I? There we go. Put nice little countertops on. No. There we go. And how about uh what's those cool uh Dark Oak fancy workbench. It's not a crafting table, it's a workbench. And, you know, it still works. I mean, you can't really put anything down there, though, I think. Let's get some uh, glassware up in. And get rid of that. Pint glass, snifter, champagne flute, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, martini glass, cordial glass. Uh, that's good for now. And let's, dude, get down. Get. Ugh, y'all butt face. All right, let's start with that and that. Can I? No. Alright, well let's, uh... Yeah? Glassware? Can, can these be put on the potion shelves? Uh, negative. Okay. Okay. Quarter of glass. Uh, Collins, Highball, Hurricane, Margarita! Old Fashioned, okay. Wine, shot, sherry, coupe, or coupe, or who the hell even knows. Okay, I want to know how you get wine. Inquiring minds want to know. And I'm going to need to uh, get some extra. How do you even, how do you even make these? Can you make these? Okay, I'm gonna... Son, go away. Ah, okay. Well, there's that. <laughs> Alright, now this is gonna be fun. Wine. Can I make wine? 
here we are. Oh, apricot wine, banana wine, cherry wine, elderberry wine. Hot diggity. Oh, this is all uh, Benny Core stuff. I gotta, I gotta ask, how, how do you wine? How do you wine? It's not gonna tell me how to wine. Fine, I'm going elderberry wine, red wine. I'll take some of that. Take some champagne, fortified wine. Fruit wine to, ugh. Pineapple wine, cranberry, citrus, agave, otherwise known as tequila. Well, no, maybe it is actual wine. I don't know. Banana wine, that doesn't even sound good. Cherry wine, elderberry, plum, uh, sake, yeah. Carrot, whoa. And uh, a nice little white. Ah, oh, there we go. And we'll just uh, kind of randomly distribute these. What other kind of drinkable things do we have here? Um, juice? Any juices that look good? Dude? Get. That boy. Oh, the uh, Magical Crops juice. There's the, the Pam's juice. Beetle, ew. Beetle juice. Carrot, uh-huh. Okay, so again, the, the question remains. No, I don't want a juicer. How? How do you get? Uh, dude, get down. Ugh, butt face. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's, um, I'm gonna get some orange juice, whoops, some orange juice, because that's a good mixer. Um, we got fig, pomegranate, otherwise, okay, some grenadine, I'll take that. Lime juice, that's a good mixer. Grape papaya, apple juice, melon juice, carrot juice, strawberry, grape. You know, I'm gonna get some tomato, some tomato juice. Uh, that, that's a thing I can get, right? Tomato juice, there we go. Uh, you know, you might want a Bloody Mary. Okay. And the tomato juice. Okay, cool. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, sodas. Alright, here we go. Uh, cherry and some cola. Get some um, lemon lime soda, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. And I know we got ginger ale. Dude, get <sighs> ginger ale. And we'll put that away. Oops. Oh, can we not? Can we, can we not? Oh, that's bogus. Okay, fine. Um, regular shelf. Okay. Here. Give me these back. Uh-oh. Um, sacrifice something. There. That can go away. There. Let's put that there. Put ginger ale there. Put, uh, lemon lime soda nudge nudge wink wink there. Thank you, Meteor Shield. I appreciate you that there and give me these back because these can go on regular shelves and like so and like so and um, like so right, so uh, there is the uh, the bar so far and let's throw some bar stools down here uh, A dark oak seat. <laughs> you who? Uh, yeah, there we go. Dark seat. And we'll just um, doop, doop, doop. There we go. That, that's not dark oak. That's dark wood. That's not what I really wanted. But you know what? Screw it. <laughs> Oh, rum. God, we gotta have rum. Tell me this goes on a potion shelf. It does. Good. 
Okay, uh, folks, um, I didn't get nearly as much done today as I, I was hoping to, but um, next time we will continue to work on my, um, my private chambers. So thanks for joining us, folks, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Okay, you know what? That's, uh, I got bars flying everywhere. There we go.